Hey guys, it's Heather the Crochet Witch. How are you guys doing? Um, so if I have permission to show this, you guys will be seeing this video. And if not, I guess you won't be. Um, but today I received what I thought initially was the other um, wool warehouse order that I was waiting on. Still haven't got it yet, but I will, I'm sure. Um, and I was like really happy. I was like, I've never seen them put this adorable stickers type stuff on there but that is definitely a sheep sticker isn't it cute um and then i realized that this is not that order that um a very lovely couple um if i can say the name uh i'll just use first name arlie uh messaged me and said uh we have something we'd like to send you and um they said, my wife made some of these beautiful things and we'd like to share them with you. And um, I am not even going to lie, you guys, like when I read that, that initial email from Arlie, I totally teared up. I showed some of my friends that I was standing next to at work and I was like, I genuinely can't believe that somebody cared enough to think of me when they saw things and wanted to send it. And um, knew me so well that they were like, this is something Heather would like. You know, like, that blows my mind. <laughs> so I, I genuinely thank you, even just for stirring up that happy feeling. I really do. Um, and, uh, I, of course, I said yes because, yeah, definitely send it because that's, that is, like, so sweet and so touching and, like, legit. I have, like, those happy feelings again even just talking about it and we haven't even opened it up. Like... Honestly, just from seeing that little sticker, that that's the kind of thing, like, if I send stuff, I like to throw stickers on things. And I don't know, the, to me, that's just an extra little touch that they did not have to do. And um, it's sweet, and I love it already. <laughs> um, so I'm going to attempt to very gently cut in. You guys are actually opening it with me right now. How about that? Instead of me pre-opening. So you're also going to see me mortified if I accidentally cut anything. But we're going to try to be very gentle. Okay. Which I do, while I'm opening this, I will just say also, I do now have a P.O. box that I list. Um, I got it because, of, if you guys remember the uh, whole disappearing of my... Bath and Body Works packages, I thought it would be beneficial to have a P.O. box uh, here. So I have that. And then I thought, well, why not share that in case, you know, then nobody has to like message me and ask me for an address. It's just right there. So you don't ever have to send me anything. I'm not asking that. I'm just saying if you do or like a card, cards are so sweet, you know, and an easy, nice little sentiment. So like if that's, I know a lot of people like to send cards. I'm going to quit babbling. My, anyway, I have a P.O. box and it's easier now. <laughs> um, so we are packed in this. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Okay. This is packed in a nice other little bag. So I'm going to have to be very careful to not to cut this one also. Uh, First and foremost, there is a card, because of course we should always, is that hand stamped? This looks hand stamped, oh my gosh. That is so awesome looking. How cool is this? And the back has a really pretty little shiny sticker. I haven't even opened it yet and I'm like, Ugh! That is so pretty. That's a, yes. Yeah. I'm gonna show you again. That's like a beautiful lady. Oh, I love, love, love that. Uh, even the, um, the paper on the envelope, like it has a handmade look to it. Okay. Oh my gosh. 
Okay, so here is, look at this. That is totally like a stamped image on there, right? Or there's, you guys didn't draw that. That's, did you? <laughs> and it's been watercolored for like an accent on it. Oh my gosh, that's so beautiful. I love that. All right, make sure. Oh, the card picture is Black Phillip, if you guys are familiar with who that is. I won't um, go into detail on who that is, because uh, I know some people don't love to talk about it, but um, that's really cool. And if you do know who it is, I hope you think it's as cool as I do. Oh, oh, okay. Um, I, I'm not gonna, since I don't have permission even yet to show you guys the video, I'm not gonna read the card out loud. Like it's not, um, terribly personal, but I, just in case, but, oh my gosh. Okay. And the envelope picture, by the way, like I said, the card picture was black Phillip. The envelope picture is mama Bridget. <laughs> Oh, line of cuts by my wife. Oh, Arlie's wife is terribly, terribly. Oh, okay. I see the serpents and stuff now. I, I missed while I was like ooing and eyeing over it right here. And she's got one up by her shoulder. Okay. Um, I don't know what I was just saying because I started talking about the... Okay, anywho, she, uh, Arlie's wife is uh, apparently very talented. Like, I haven't opened the stuff yet, but uh, Arlie was telling me about the different things that she does and showing me some pictures. And uh, this says the... line. I hope I'm saying it right, but the line of cuts, line of cuts uh, were by her also. Very talented. Um, a lot of things. So... That card, that card alone would have made my day. I'm just going to point that out. Okay, let me... Do I take everything out of the bag first? Oh my gosh. I will say, in the card, uh, Arlie said I've included some extras. Uh, because who doesn't like like extras? And um, you're not wrong. We're not wrong. That's very sweet. All right. Get everything out of the protective bag. So what is inside is this beautiful wrapped box, which I'm gonna open in a second. I just wanted to show you guys like what came and how it came. There is this awesome, oh my gosh, this is a, like a zip baggie. So there is like a little Ziploc baggie and can you see the, um, there's bats and there's pumpkins. So this is like a little Halloween, like a treat bag kind of thing. Oh my gosh, okay. And then there's another mysteriously sealed, like a treat bag with more pumpkins. And then there are these two wrapped, wrapped in tissue, orange tissue and skulls. Look at the little skulls, aren't those cute? They're so cute, you guys. I, this is so me, like you definitely know me. Um, definitely know my like, can't even talk right now. <laughs> Definitely know my like aesthetic for sure. Um, if this is also your aesthetic, which I'm assuming it is since you have all this lovely stuff. Um, and I know your wife is goth. I hope that's okay to share, but I know you said your wife is goth. And so you probably do share my love and aesthetic for these things. So you have great taste, just so you guys know. <laughs> um, I'm going to start by opening this um, baggie that I showed you guys and in it is a tin I felt that oh it's a Mary Shelley it's a Mary Shelley Frankenstein there's a print with hearts on this top of this tin and it has Mary Shelley on the bottom it says Frankenstein actually right there I'm not sure if I'm holding this close enough so you guys can see it but you can definitely see the hearts on that and oh wow okay so I don't know how to open it and show you guys without um 
it has on the back of this that it is fandom blends a d a g i o dot com that is totally gonna get blown out on my almost saw it <laughs> that's a little bit better so that's printed on the back of it and when you open it oh is this incense Okay, it's loose, so I can't really tilt it forward. But this is, um, if you want to get an idea of the texture, this is like tobacco-y feeling, like a dry tobacco almost. It's not, it's, it's not. But it smells like incense. And the whole, the whole tin is like a dry incense. If you're not familiar with incense, you're able to um, have like a hot coal or... Um, a fire if you prefer it, uh, keeping a fire and you throw some in and it's aromatic herbs that's that's all it is it's nothing nothing bad um and it smells amazing actually um it didn't say in anything that i've opened yet what it is for sure but i'm guessing that that's what this is um so can you guys let me know for sure so I'm not wrong <laughs> or if I am wrong so I know what it is um but I'm almost positive that's what it is and this little tin is adorable that it oh my gosh you guys so I didn't know that that was coming so that's an extra and that is an amazing extra that smells I have a bad 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 sense of smell but that smells um like it's patchouli or sandalwood I may be wrong about that, but I know I burn all these incenses and stuff, but I do have a really bad sense of smell. <laughs> incense is usually stronger when it's burnt anyway, so if that's what it is, I'm sure I'll definitely know when I... <gasps> okay, I was talking and I should have mentioned that I was opening this little box right here. And this is one of the things that I knew was coming. And I told you that Arlie's wife is very... Uh, awesome and good and artistic at things um okay so there's several things in here i'm going to save the the big piece de resistance for the end of it but these i want to like place this carefully okay so these are like little stitch markers with skulls and beads and there's a white one and an orange one and little black shiny beads and they're hooked together it's two of them they're just hooked together that's awesome those are so pretty okay so those came in the box and then um there is this twist of like thread yarn thread uh I need to get a little closer to the camera to show you guys. I need to move. Now that I got my mic, I need to get my camera set up just a bit closer. Um, but those colors are beautiful, are they not? They're like a washed um, orange and purple. Very Halloween-y. There's a little bit of white from where the wash is with it. And that's a twist of... Uh, like thread of yarn and there is a note on it that says trailhead yarns 100% tensile and uh, trailheadyarns.com is also written on there come on why are we not focusing today there we go and then okay I'm gonna stay standing for this to show you guys um, I believe Arlie said this was made out of polymer clay, but, uh, his wife sculpted. Isn't that little bat adorable? It's so detailed. Like, it's so detailed. I wish, I hope that you guys can see this. I am slightly being blinded by my light, so I'm not sure how well it's. And there is... There's a hole to hang it, because he's meant to hang. I love him so much. This is like the most precious thing. Oh, I love this. I love it so much. 
Oh, I love him so much. Your wife did such a beautiful job. Like, there's no question at all what it is. There's no question about anything, how well made it is. It's well made. It's so well made. Like, that's beautiful. I love Bat so much. It's He's perfect. He's perfect. Oh, I love that. I love that so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <sighs> like, seriously, that I'm just like, each thing that I've opened, I'm like, that alone would have been plenty. Like, <laughs> the card alone would have been plenty. <laughs> um, this, I'm assuming, is an extra also that was included because I'm pretty sure I know what the other packages contain. So I'm, that's why I'm saving them for the last because I know that they're amazing. So we're going to open up this little package here. What is... What is this? Okay, so not like unstraightened out or anything yet. We have this really pretty lacy fish netty type material tied up. And it says made with... Marinol alpaca silk on the tag. And it's this like bright, vibrant, like beautiful Halloween orange. So I'm going to, even the, the tie around it is purple. Oh no, I lost the tag. I'll get that in a second. Um, it's purple, black, and green. Perfect, like witchy colors in my opinion. Oh, that's so cute. All right, so let's unwrap this. It's quite a... It's definitely like crocheted, very delicate. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. Okay. So it's basically made like a fishnet. Like, uh, you can see that, I'm sure. But I'm... This is... <sighs> And it's like you can see the little halo on it from the alpaca. Look how delicate that is. That is so, so amazing. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. This had to have taken just forever. I love it. Oh. I don't know if it was you or your wife who made this. I don't know if your wife crochets, honestly. Um, she has so many other beautiful things. I'm 99% certain one of you guys did make it, though. And I love it. Oh my gosh, you're so talented. And so patient. Oh my gosh, this is so thin and like just delicate and oh. Look at that. Oh my gosh. That is so perfect. This is wonderful. Thank you. Thank you so much. I did not know this was coming. This is definitely a surprise. This is be Oh my gosh. Look at that. I love this. I love this so much. Thank you so much. I love it. It's actually, I've always felt like fishnet was kind of warm for how holy it was, like ironically anyway, and I'm actually warm already from having this on. <laughs> I love it. Thank you again so much. So much. Oh, okay. All right. All right. All right. So should we go with which one? You know, the smaller one? Okay. Go with the orange one first. Oh, wow. Of acrylic? Oh my gosh. Okay. I'm like making a mess with all the wrapping around. Okay, so um, the tags. Um, let me explain. Arlie's wife also spins. This woman is the most talented person I've ever heard of. <laughs> She's amazing. And um, they wanted to send me some yarn that she had made. <sighs> okay, so 
this purple one, this is, and oh my gosh, this is like almost exactly the like, when I described it as dark neon purple, uh, this is almost exactly the color that I'm using in my um, Halloween blanket that I've been making. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> um, it says that this is approximately 250 yards. It's 80% acrylic and 20% wool. How beautiful is that? And it's mate right here. It says it is approximately 190 yards and it is 100% acrylic. I didn't even know you could do that with acrylic. How pretty, how pretty is that? Like, that is a very ghoulish-looking green. I love it so much. The two together are amazing. And with this orange, oh my gosh, this is wonderful. I love, love, love this. This is like a Halloween birthday. <laughs> okay, so then is this other package with the cute little skulls. I really love this paper so much. I hope the crinkling's not overwhelming with this new mic. I'm still getting used to it, and I didn't even think about that until right now. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, these are wonderful. Okay, let me show you guys what I'm freaking out about. Look at these. Look at these. And I... Oh, yeah. Arlie said, I knew that, like, you would love these. And we thought of you. And, like, she had made these. And you are so right. Um, okay. All right. Um, this uh, is from, they both say, I'm gonna, probably going to mispronounce this, Sarah Cloth Fibers. C-E-R-E-C-L-O-T-H. Sarah Cloth Fibers. The colorway on this one, we're going to talk about this one. I'll show it again. Um, the colorway is Harvest Moon. It contains merino, sari silk, and it is approximately 250 yards. Hand wash, lay flat to dry. And she has, just before I show you again with the, um, the show you the yarn again, on the, the ball band, the wrapper, there are more beautiful stamps. Look at the raven or crow. I love them both. It doesn't matter which they actually are. <laughs> Look at that. Oh my gosh. Okay. And then I'm going to... And this is... um, It's this beautiful like roving yarn. And it's got these like antique like vintage. There's... I see... This deep purple color there that's hinted in there. There's avocado green with like some gold. Um, there is like a deep, like a rust orange, which you know I love. There's a more pumpkin-y lighter orange. Um, there's an even lighter orange. There's uh, a gold, if I didn't mention that already, spun in there. I see some brown. This is just like a retro-y, eclectic color <laughs> combination. And I love this so much that's gorgeous your wife does so beautiful her work is so beautiful and the other one to show you guys um there are more stamps and it didn't hit me on the other one until i just looked at this one even though it's the same stamp but this very much looks like the top of a witch's hat <laughs> with stars on it how pretty is that <laughs> and then there is the lovely raven and or crow and or raven or crow and this one is also sarah cloth fibers the colorway is pumpkin harvest uh, it contains non-superwash merino approximately 180 yards also hand wash and lay flat to dry like that even the label has like this cute like washi tape on it <laughs> it's very halloweeny also um there are i told you it was called pumpkin harvest that's a beautiful name too so there is a tinge of like blue and green mixed in here and i see some red primarily though this is the beautiful um oranges and like a goldish orange 
like a brownish orange. Um, there is gold also, it looks like. Oh, my gosh. And there's just, just these random pops of, like, this is a blue and there's a green pop in here, too. That is so pretty. Oh, my gosh. I love... <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Excuse me. I've been talking so long, my throat got dry. And I've been, like, <gasps> like every time. <sighs> Sorry. <laughs> um, I don't have words to tell you guys how much I love and appreciate this. Um, you're 100% right that this was very, very heathery stuff. And I love this. All of it. Like, I know I'm just currently holding... I, there's so much I can't even hold it all up. But um, I definitely can't... I definitely can't thank you guys enough. Um this is so special. <laughs> like, I love it. I love the little bat. I love the tin. I love, I love the card. I love the card. This is so cool. I am going to treasure this forever. I love this. I was wearing it so it wasn't in front of me for me to look at. I love it. Like this wrap, I might even use it like as more of a mesh scarf or head wrap or anything. <laughs> I love this. So, um, thank you so, 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 so much. Even like, I even, I love this. <laughs> I love all of this stuff. It's got just such a, a personal touch. Um, I forgot to show you guys when I showed you the twist of, of the thread yarn. It also says that this is electric love. <laughs> you are not going to be able to see that, but there's a little tag here that says electric love. And I'm going to show you that again. If it's not blown out. Ugh. Okay, I have to dim the lights down a little bit when I get it closer to me, I think. But, um, yeah, I don't want to, like, drone on and repeat myself, but I, I do so much appreciate this, and I love it so much, and I really, truly thank you so, so much. And I hope that I have permission to show this video so that everybody can see this amazing stuff, because this is, this is gorgeous. Um, and uh, I don't know if this is more of, like, a, a pleasure uh, make or if your wife like sells things but um, if she does you should uh, comment and let me know and um, we'll drop her information uh, here for everybody if you want because this sh this is should be shared and this is just beautiful <sighs> I love it I love it so so much I really can't tell you how much I appreciate and love it so all right I'm gonna quit showing it off <laughs> And I'm going to go because um, I do have to get ready for work. But this is the highlight of my day. This is the highlight of my week. Like, I love it. Thank you so much, both of you guys. Thank you. Um, and, yeah, I will, just, I will talk to you guys later. <laughs> I love you guys so much. Thank you so, so much. Bye, guys.